Y'all know what I always forget to do is to actually include a intro to the video. So the first clip that you're gonna see is not today. Today is the appointment of, uh, today is the day that I have my appointment with my surgeon to discuss a revision. But welcome back to the channel. If you don't know, I hope you see me saying it and not spraying it because I definitely sprayed it. Um, my name is Hillary. Welcome back to the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and of course, subscribe. Please, if you're watching the video, just hit that subscribe button. Don't even wait. Don't even, I ain't even gonna ask you for the notification bell like that right now. So just hit subscribe. All right, here's the video. All right, you guys, where am I heading to? It's been a while since I've done the video, you guys. Um, I need to get my life together. <laughs> so I am actually heading over to oh before i do that welcome back to the channel it is nice to have each of you um yeah so i think i know where i'm going <laughs> so i'm actually um if i don't if i don't i'll figure it out once i once i get there um i am actually heading to i call it the fat doctor <laughs> but i am heading back to this weight loss clinic that um my insurance pays for to get back onto fentamine because your girl has gained like 15 pounds since surgery all right um i had if you all don't know i think i, I think i did a video about it um or mentioned it in the video um i had covid after we got back from vegas and that was the lowest I have been uh, since having my son, which was 178. I'm sitting on scale the other day, y'all. I was like 191. I'm about to officially find out once I go to um, the clinic um, to, re like I said, to restart my fanfan because your girl needs it. Um, I, yeah, I just need to get back on track. Um, luckily, I actually like the summer times at work because it's really quiet at the school and in the mornings I walk the track so starting next week I'll be back walking um, walking in the morning and in the afternoons and yeah I'm hoping that this phenamine will work it did last time um, I've just I know I'm saying oh my god I need to just take a pause and I'm going to say I am so, all right so yeah i am heading to that appointment now i have this is going to be like a compliment uh compilation we're going to stream some videos together so it's saturday may 28th i have an appointment with dr wise on Tuesday the 31st to possibly discuss a revision. Um, I think I need lipo on one area that's a little bit more puffy than the other side. And I think I've shown you all that in videos. If not, I'll show you on my way to the appointment on Tuesday. Um, so yeah, that's it. I know it's been a while since I've done an update. So on Tuesday, you know what? I'll give you all a, uh, a tummy tuck update too, along with this. I've still been trying to figure out what type of videos or what direction I want my channels to go in. That's honestly why I have not done videos. I think I'm just going to randomly put up some stuff. And if it's sick, it's sick. If it don't, you know what? It's up. We can move on. All right. One thing that I do know that I want to talk about is my skincare. I have, um, yeah, I'll do a skincare vlog on, um, also, I try to get that up this week. I am very minimal when it comes to skincare, but I don't know, y'all, I don't know what happened between like January and April, but my skin was like out of damn control. I think I've been on here long enough to cuss. But um it was out of it was out of control. Um between the acne, the scarring, like I could not stand like looking in the mirror. I would constantly um, putting on makeup. It was, it, my skin was a mess. It was a mess. So I'm trying out this new product and I did my, 
was it like my two week my four week pictures and the change that i have seen in four weeks i cannot i cannot believe it i did have um i do have a mark a new spot that recently came on my face but it healed really really fast this time so i think the product is working when you see my my one month before and after y'all gonna be like oh yeah girl so i'm gonna stick with it just like weight loss i know that skincare takes takes a while i actually um I want to reach out to an esthetician because during the, I have to do a lot of stuff during the summertime, you guys, because at the school, well, I can do it during the, during breaks at the school, but I'm trying to, get, you know, be popping for next school year. So I want to reach out to my esthetician or to a esthetician um, to inquire about maybe potentially doing a chemical peel, but I need to see if what I'm currently on will, uh, will affect that so i'm gonna do that um yeah yeah so that's it y'all i'm about to like i said i'm about to go to my little fat clinic i'll show you all once i get there i'll be there shortly bye right, so i'm back at the plastic surgeon's office changed into my gown so this is my left side this is the side that we're gonna talk about today so as soon as we're done i will give you an update all right, you guys, I'm going to see if I can do this really quickly because I just finished my appointment. And then once I get in the car, I'll let you know everything what the doctor said. But these are my results so far. Now, I have gained about 15, my 15 pounds since surgery. So I want to be walking this summer and fixing my diet and starting back my fentanyl. You've seen that earlier in the vlog. But um, this is a side that we discussed today. So he's actually going to go in and lipo. I have a small little tiny dog ear right here that he's going to clip off also and this is what trying not to get flat but this is what my scar is looking like now keep in mind i did not have um lipo he said my scar is looking well um and yeah i know like all of this to come in as i um excuse girls as i start to lose weight so let me get back on my clothes and then we'll finish this discussion in the car all right, you guys, so I am leaving the doctor's office now. Gotta head back to work. My shit play. And my bottle of water. I got a frosted coffee, y'all, and not gonna lie, I wasted my money because I feel guilty having it, so it's just literally sitting here melting. Y'all so about to start, but why y'all ain't tell me um, that I'm this, uh, that piece, a piece of my lock was so just, you poking, just seen poking out? In the All right, let me get back. Clip, um, it wasn't really like a full, full body update. I'll probably come back when it's closer to my revision date. So let's talk about that. So, um, I am now six months post-op. So we'll consider this my six month update. I'm six months post-op. Um, my appointment today was to discuss possibly having a revision on my left side because um, when I wear like foreign fitting dresses, there's like a small like little lump on my left side that I can see. Um, my last appointment, Dr. Wise wasn't there. I seen his physician assistant. So they actually scheduled me to come see, um, to see him today. He checked me out um, and he decided um, what, pops, what, what he thinks happened is I had a lot of built up scar tissue on my right side which helped it which helped that side be a lot lot tighter and i didn't have it on my left side as much scar tissue build up from c-sections or whatnot he's going to go in he's going to do some liposuction and he is going to clip off that little dog ear that you all kind of see me flicking so he asked me if it bothered me and i was like yeah i said when i take out my clothes you know i just boop, boop, boop. <laughs> at it sometimes you know it's not like a huge dog ear but it is there so he's gonna do that and then hopefully that will be it um i asked to have my surgery on october the 12th for a few reasons number one i am transitioning into teaching uh for the upcoming school year at a high school so I didn't want to, if I was in my current position, I would have just been like, you know what, it is what it is. I'm not responsible for anyone. 
blase blase but i wanted to schedule it so i wouldn't interrupt a lot of class time and wouldn't use a lot of leave so if i'm not mistaken if it is scheduled for the 12th i only have to take two days off because that friday is a school a weather day so the school is closed and then that 17th is another holiday for some reason maybe it's columbus day indigenous people day okay you know we won't do murderers over here so um indigenous people day is on the 17th i believe so i think that is why we have that day off i'm not sure but i gotta look at the calendar again but anywho my date is potentially scheduled for october the third that also gives me time to lose the weight that i want to lose and it's enough time to heal prior to my graduation ceremony that i'll be attending in arizona in december so there were several factors that made me schedule on um, for for that day i am excited i'm happy like i said it gives me enough time to lose the weight that i would like to lose get my body up into tip-top shape start preparing again for surgery even though this procedure is going to be a lot minor than that is I still want my body to heal um, properly um, so yeah like I said I got my date this will be my six month update I ask you all this at the end of every single video what do you want to see from this channel I have no idea you guys that's why I haven't been uploading well number one we moved I don't know where the my tripod or my lighting system is um, our apartment is a lot smaller than the house so i just ain't been I, I ain't gonna lie i haven't been knowing what to um upload i was i've been watching like um decorate my classroom ideas from secondary teachers and so i'm thinking about doing that once um uh, once we come back for pre-planning in august now currently my current position is i'm a 12-month employee so teachers work 10 months in the state of florida um, I am a 12 month employee as a principal secretary currently. So I'm gonna be at the school the entire time. I'm gonna kinda talk to my principal, see, hey, you know, if it's so if it's all right if I go once um the person's position that I'm taking officially turns in her resignation letter. Um, I'm gonna ask them, hey, do you mind like if a few days if I go up and she start prepping, if you all know like where classrooms are gonna be this year, I would greatly appreciate it. So yeah excited about um that so maybe i can do some of those videos it's about to be the summertime school is boring i'm finishing up my last set of classes i think i have like three weeks left of classes uh before i get my bachelor's degree it'll be a long long time coming you know what that'll be my next story time once i finish my i turn in my last assignment actually my teachers are letting it or saying they're due early on june 22nd but the last official day of classes is june the 24th and i will have completed 200 uh 200 121 hours um obtaining my bachelor's degree so maybe i'll do like a motivation to get back started because i am a older college student i'm 32 years old my path to this was was a lot different than what i expected when i was 18 so maybe that can encourage somebody you know so yeah that's that'll be the next video now after that y'all hey we're gonna be shooting in the dark like i said shooting in the dark and hoping something lands if that's the saying it's gonna be the saying today all righty then so i think this video will be long enough until next time bye bye